Hey, how's it going everyone? Michael back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create an email alert for every time in a document library an item gets changed. So this is pretty simple. SharePoint has it, so you don't need to go into Power Automate and do it. It's all built into SharePoint online. So you want to navigate to your SharePoint you want to work with. In this video, I'm going to be working with my marketing SharePoint. And I'm just on the home page right now, so let's navigate over to the document library documents. All right, so as you can see, we have a toolbar at the top with a few options, but we want to go to the triple dot, alert me, and this will bring up a pop up. Let me zoom in here. Alert me when items change. Alert title. Uh, this is your title for your email. I'm going to say, we'll just leave it documents for now, so it, it'll tell you which file. Um, comes in second option send alerts to so right now it's just alerting me if you have a group of users you want to alert you can go ahead and add them all here uh, they might have to be in your organization they might not depending on how you set up the point online is set up send alerts by so i don't have my text messaging set up i only have the email so every time a new alert comes in it'll be sent by myself and you can specify what type of change you want to be uh, you want so for this change type I only want when new items are added you can do any of them you want it's you pretty much use your preference but I'll leave it new items are added send alert for these changes send me alert when anything changes someone else changes document I'll leave it for anything changes because I want it doesn't matter who uploads a file I want to be notified about it when to send alerts, so you can send this on daily, weekly. I want to send the notification immediately because it's just personal preference. So let's go ahead and press OK on this. And if we go in and click on the triple dot again, click on Manage My Alerts, you can see that the alert is set up. So let's go ahead and add a file. So let me pull in a file. I'll just toss in a test file, tax document. So this will take a, I think it took me around a minute or two to get the email. Uh, currently my email um, is disabled because my SharePoint online is disabled right now, but my flow does work. And as you can see, uh, we got the notification right here. I have a flow. So every time an email gets sent to my inbox, it will send me the details in a flow alert. So we can actually see the email right here. A new email has been received. Here are the details. So the email was sent from SharePoint online. You have successfully created an alert for documents. All right, just sending me the, so this email is just sending me, hey, you set up a new alert for the documents folder. And now we're just waiting on the, the alert for the new file that came in. All right, looks like I got another alert for emails that came in. Go ahead and take a look. So my flow, new email has been received, yada yada, the sender, SharePoint online, subject, documents, and then it will list the file name that was uploaded. Uh, the body uh, just has a picture in there, and it says the file has been added. I modify my alert settings, view documents. So if I click on view documents, it'll take me straight to the documents folder. As you can see, we have a new file uploaded there. So that's pretty much it. If you want to turn off the alert, you can go back into triple dot, manage alerts. Click on the checkbox, delete selected alerts, and you can go ahead and delete it if you want that. But that's how you set up an alert for every time a new item is uh, changed in a document library. If you like the video, feel free to like, subscribe, comment. If you have any video ideas, feel free to let me know, and that'll be it.